Will Smith is one of those timeless celebrities with so many successes under his belt that it's hard to count. From movies, TV, even music, the man has done it all. He was even named the most powerful actor in Hollywood at one point. At the time of this recording, Will is 51, which is hard to believe since he looks so damn young. He has three children, two with his longtime wife and actress, Jada Pinkett Smith, who is 48 at the moment. Will definitely has a beautiful family and along with all of that, a beautiful place that they call home to. Will and his wife Jada are both successful in their own right and currently Will has almost 40 million followers on Instagram while Jada has almost 10 mil. The two have both used the platform to share glimpses into their beautiful mansion in the past as well, so if you follow either of them you may have gotten a good idea of what their place looks like. Of course, when two Hollywood actors create a lasting marriage and strong partnership, they also combine their wealth. Will and Jada are certainly not hurting in that department either, with a combined net worth that's estimated at around 320 million US dollars. Of course, you can buy a mansion or five with that kind of cash. The couple has invested into more than one property over the years, including a vacation house in Hawaii, and Will even has his own epic and giant RV he lives in when he films movies. Will and Jada's current mansion is really something else though. It even has its own zip code and seems like more of a private resort than a house. But we'll get into Will's home in a lot more detail after. Hey guys, it's Kara and today we're doing another house tour here on Famous Entertainment. We're gonna look at where Will Smith and his family calls home, including the mega mansion in Cali as well as the previous home in Hawaii and his RV that could double as another home. If you like these videos, make sure you're subscribed and ring that bell to be notified when we post so you can always be up to date. We've also done house tours on the likes of Selena Gomez and on Justin and Hailey Bieber, and we'll have links to those at the end of this. I've also been reading all your comments and I'm going to be responding to some at the end of this video. I need you to let me know who to do next in the comments down below and whose home you'd like to see. Now let's get into this video. Let's start with Will's Hawaii real estate. Although Will sold this place a couple of years ago, this property in Kauai is worth mentioning. It seems the family has had a thing for Hawaii considering this was the second house they bought and sold there. The one before was sold in 2011 for a rumored 20 mil. This mansion was located on Secret Beach on the North Shore of Kauai and Will paid 10 million for it when they got it, but they resold it for 12 million. The home was on seven acres of beachfront and had two separate gated entrances. This place was actually made up of four different buildings instead of just one. There was a main house of course which had three beds and 3.5 baths, vaulted ceilings and two fireplaces. It was pretty open concept but all of the doors and windows were necessary to enjoy the perfect view of the water. There was also a guest house with two beds and two baths, a slightly smaller carriage house with one bed and one bath, and the fourth building was a studio. Other features of Will's multi-million dollar Hawaii house included a pool, spa, tennis court, and of course private beach access. Even though the Smiths didn't keep the Hawaii home for long, I'm sure with a spot like that they enjoyed plenty of perfect vacations when Will wasn't working. I mean Hawaii is a dream destination. Before we get into Will's main mansion in LA, let's look at his luxurious movie trailer. I wasn't sure if we should count an RV as part of the house tour, but this one gets a pass because it's pretty crazy. Will's RV even has its own name. That's right, it's been nicknamed The Heat. Will's one-of-a-kind trailer is two stories and 1,200 square feet, because obviously the man needs to be comfortable when he stars in hit movies. I bet after those long days on set, he gets to go back to the nicest trailer around. The price tag on this mobile home is no joke though. Will paid a total of 2.5 million. If you're wondering what a few mil will get you on 22 wheels, I'm here to tell you, and I'll show you. Will's RV features 14 TV screens, because why not? 13K worth of leather and over 100K worth of technology. There's of course a dressing room and a 30 person movie theater. The heat also includes a full kitchen and a lounge area separated with sliding doors while Will goes to get into character. One of the bathrooms is worth 25K and runs along the full width of the trailer. The second floor of Will's RV can get 42 inches higher as well by raising the roof. So it's basically a transformer. If you want to get a feel for this size, it's really like condensing five big trailers into one massive one. Now it's time to look at the main attraction, Will's Mega Mansion family home in Calabasas, California. Calabasas, as you probably know, is a celebrity-filled neighborhood, so it's no doubt the movie star chose to reside here. There's plenty of privacy, yet he's still close enough to Hollywood. Will's mansion is worth a crazy 42 mil, but I wouldn't expect anything less from the star. Him and his wife Jada live most of the time here with their kids, and there's certainly more than enough space for everyone. This multi-million dollar mansion is 25,000 square feet and sits on 150 acres of land. It has an impressive nine bedrooms. I'm sure around the same amount of bathrooms and the garage holds about eight cars. So I'm going to get my car in the garage. So I ran 
that table talk is like taking over the house and I think uh, Jada doesn't recognize this a house. There are a bunch of unique features and rooms in Will's house and we'll see what makes his so epic. Firstly, Will's home is so expansive it has its own zip code. And when you see the property from above, you'll understand why. It looks more like a resort. For such a massive space, the Smith family home is pretty intimate and homey. Mostly because that is the vibe Will wanted to create in the first place. So Jada did all of this for Christmas. Jada has, uh, Jada did this, all this stuff for Christmas. Because we usually go out of town, we don't usually decorate. So Jada decided to decorate this year. Ah, oh, babe, the shot just went past you, and then I went up to, bow, oh. To make that happen, Will and Jada had everything custom made by woodworkers, stonemasons, you name it. And the architect, Steven Samuelson, took on the project of designing this place. Construction began way back in 2003 and didn't finish until the end of 2010. Will said about his home, everything needed to be done by hand. We wanted to feel the love and labor that went into every piece of this place. The vibe of Will's home is adobe style, so it has a rustic look, the interior is earthy and has inspiration from the African culture. There are also a bunch of handcrafted details like their front door which was saved from a fort in northern India. One of the living rooms in the mansion offers an amazing view of the hills and an open concept. It looks like there are accents from around the world as well to suit the vibe of the home. Looking at Will's dining room, you can see the color theme is similar with lots of orange and more wood accents. Of course, the furniture here, like the table, is handcrafted as well. And moving to the kitchen, it's perfectly matched to the rest of the house. All of the bedrooms in the Smith family home are gorgeous, but of course the master suite is the most impressive. Will and Jada's room is really spacious and they have a gorgeous bathroom, balcony, and a walk-in closet. Some more fancy rooms in Will's mansion include a Moroccan-themed movie theater, a recording studio where his daughter Willow has recorded some songs, a meditation room, and a pool room. Moving outside, of course, there's a pool and plenty of space to enjoy sports, including a full basketball court, volleyball court, and tennis court. All right, sit down. I mean, stand up. Okay, I'm, I'm really confused by the direction. I'm the director, do what I say. Okay. Wait, who did his wardrobe? There's also a huge trampoline. And I wonder if Will uses that too. One thing that drew the Smiths to this property they bought was the man-made lake with gorgeous views. Will kept it during the redesign, so aside from the pool, there's a small lake, but the family does have 150 acres of land to spare. The gazebo that sits by the lake is actually Will's fave spot at home because he goes there to think and said, answers come to me out there. And if that's not enough space to unwind, the meditation room also offers views of the sky, so you can always lay out and look at the stars. Hopefully you can see them better in the hills than downtown. So we've seen the $42 million custom mansion that Will and his family call home, as well as the crazy RV he uses as a movie trailer, which could double as a home, and even a place they recently sold in Hawaii. Even though their Calabasas estate is more than enough property, Will and Jada are said to own more. Apparently they own a five bed and six bath home in Hidden Hills, where we know all the Kardashian-Jenner family basically lives. But apparently since 2017, their son Jaden is living in that house. Maybe that's why him and Kylie were so close, because they were neighbors. On top of that, Will supposedly owns another house in LA's Woodland Hills area, Area, a mansion in Pennsylvania with over three acres of land and a place in Park City, Utah. But you get the idea, him and Jada have quite a bit. I want to know what you guys think. Do you like Will's family mansion or is it too over the top? I think it really suits the family and the Smiths were definitely able to make a mansion that's so massive still feel like a home. Okay guys, so now I'll be reading a few of your comments from previous videos. On our Kourtney Kardashian house tour, Nick Lee said, Love Court's house and your vids. Thanks Nick, I like our house too and thanks for the positive feedback. On our Justin and Haley Bieber house tour, Enya Shello said, That house shows no sign of a woman living there. One of the many red flags in this relationship. I didn't notice that till you pointed it out, but it's kind of true. I wonder what that implies. But I wouldn't be cool with a manly house if I was Haley. That's a bit weird. Finally, on our recent Selena Gomez house tour video, Jesse Paul said, I'm a big fan of Selena. Love her so much. So am I. She seems so sweet. I feel like she has a lot of loyal fans. And if you guys want more Selena content, let me know what videos you'd like to see. All right guys, that's all I could find on Will Smith's home. What was your favorite spot in the house? I think I like the outside best with the man-made lake and their meditation room too. Let me know in the comments and let me know some other celebrity houses you'd like to see. Follow me on Instagram if you want to chat more and I'll see you next time with some new videos. Bye.